In just a mo, I'll give you a brief explanation behind each answer, linking the vocabulary or contextual links between the text and the question. I'll be going through the answers quickly, so make sure your course book is open in front of you, and please stop and rewind the video as you need to, to take the time to find the vocabulary and contextual links that I'll be talking about. Ready? Then let's go. For question one, the answer is C. Jeanette admires the efforts made to raise funds for charity. As admire the efforts directly refers to the beginning of C, I really applaud those people, and charity refers to good causes. For question two, the answer is E. Laura thinks some people support charities out of self-interest. The idea of doing something out of self-interest is shown three quarters of the way down in D, where it says, those who only give money to charity to ease their conscience. For question three, the answer is A, Tom. The idea presented in question three can be found in the last sentence of paragraph A, when, and I'm paraphrasing here, he doesn't think giving money to homeless people directly will help them. For question four, the answer is D. Graham resents feeling pressured into giving money. The pressure to give money is reflected at the beginning of D when he says he gets annoyed when charity collectors dot 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 stand outside shops and swoop down on you trying to make you feel guilty. For question five, the answer is B. Yvette. The doubts which are raised at the, in the question text are found at the end of B when Yvette says that possibly too much money is being spent on bureaucracy instead of sending it to the people in need. For question 6, the answer is B. Yvette has mixed feelings about giving to street collectors, as the idea of mixed feelings in the question text can be seen in B when Yvette says, asking whether or not I should give money to a street collector. Then she goes on to justify these mixed feelings through various arguments. For question 7, the answer is E. Laura contributes to society in non-financial ways. Contributing in a non-financial way can be seen in E when Laura says, halfway through the text, that they do their fair share in other ways by giving blood and volunteering. For question 8, the answer is A. Tom. The idea of being impressed is communicated in A when he says that they feel moved, in a positive way, by the amount of people who make donations. For question 9, the answer is D. Graham prefers to support less fashionable charities. The idea of less fashionable charities is shown in D when he says that they give to organisations that get less publicity rather than trendy ones linked to celebrities. For question 10, the answer is C. Jeanette admits that they have given money out of a feeling of guilt. The feeling of guilt is seen in C when she says she feels ashamed when walking past when it's cold or raining. 